We're here with Steve Bocieri, founder of Heavy Putter. That was the first product, and then there was Heavy Wedge. And Steve, uh, tell us what you got now. Well, we came out with a wedge last year, and that was something that everybody who tried it said, gee, do you guys make irons? You need, I can't just play the wedge with this technology. I want the whole set. So I was pretty busy this year. I actually was able to create a full line through irons, hybrids, fairy woods, and now the driver. And I was rushed a little bit to get it here at the show. So we have a lot of the prototypes that were originally developed. And how's the uh, technology work? Okay, well the technology is that uh, everybody in the, in the market today is talking about lighter is longer. And we think that adding more head mass, but adding a, a counterbalance to the handle of the golf club raises, raises the balance point and actually allows you to have more mass at a higher speed at impact. And it promotes more control. And that's what the name of the product line is. It's the control series. So I was, I'm, a, I'm a golfer from way back. And it's nice to hit 300 yard drives, but it's nice to get them in the fairway every once in a while. How long ago did you, did you actually start with Heavy Putter? When did that come out? Heavy Putter uh, was developed about seven years ago. And that was a, a, a very interesting thing. Actually, most of the guys that started used it on tour. And that's where I went out there to prove the technology was valid. And then now it's, it's pretty commercially available throughout 30 countries and we're in over 3,000 accounts now in the United States. So the heavy putter definitely has its following. How have you personally enjoyed uh, the journey of, of this experience and the growth of your company? That's a great question actually, uh, because this is a second career. I was in the a nuclear engineering side for 25 years and golf has been my passion for my entire life. So the idea of creating a product that promotes better golfers, makes better golfers, has been a tremendous thrill for me. I wasn't good enough to play on tour, but it was, it's great to make product that people can hit and have more success with. And where, where do you go from here? Where, where's golf going from here? I mean, you, you might know because you have to figure it out. Well, my, my, my journey is to, to make golf, make everybody enjoy the game more. But it, my, my opportunity in, in the equipment area is to make product that is better and promotes better body mechanics. So I feel like this is the beginning for us because this was designed for better players in mind with the offsets that I have in the irons and the, and the playability of those irons. Once I've proved the technology, then we will be able to expand to a higher handicap level. These are more designed for the, the guy that's a 15 and he wants to be a 5. You've got uh, discerning, knowledgeable folks here, a lot of PGA teaching professionals. What kind of feedback are you getting from them? It's been absolutely fabulous. And this is exactly what I've been doing offline, but not having this many people. I've had PGA professionals hit it, higher handicappers. But today, it's been absolutely fabulous. The response is terrific. Everybody is so surprised that something that we call heavy can be swung at the speed that some of these lighter drivers are being swung at. And just last question, what's it like for you to, to, to be able to be here at the show, for people to touch and, and try your product? The, the, this to me is, it, it's the proving ground. I, I get to talk to pros from all around the country and actually get their feedback and what their customers are striving and looking for. So I listen, as much as they listen to me, I'm listening to them because that's the next product. Steve, Steve's an unbelievable, I mean, he's like a TV guy. This is incredible, <laughs> right? Thanks. Good job, Steve. We'll see you later. Appreciate it, yeah. Thank you.